to know that you've got help in there, how do you feel? Um, yes, sir, I, I knew I was going to have some help. I knew I was going to have help, you know, battling with Oscar and practice and everything. But, um, you know, today I feel like uh, Coach, he uh, let Oscar stay out there, you know, let him figure out things. And, you know, it was an exhibition game, and uh, I feel like that's why uh, he had, uh, sat me. But um, I feel like I was happy for Oscar. I'm not going to lie. I, I was really happy for him. He was out there doing his thing. He was grabbing rebounds. He was... Uh, flexing, doing all types of crazy things. So to see Oscar really come out of his shell, that's something that I, you know, I'm excited to see. Um, we'll let Hug tell her too. But, um, but I feel like as a team, we feel like we're 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 taking the right steps towards the right direction. Um, I don't know if we're really necessarily there yet, but I feel like we know what we have to do is just to put it in play. What do you feel like you have to do? I mean, what areas up to you get I feel like keeping a man in front of us, and you know, no straight line drives. You know, straight line drives uh, really hurt, uh, really hurts the most. So I feel like it helping off on the ball. So once you really do those two things, uh, that really keeps the pressure on the ball handler, and that will keeps the, uh, you know, the front, the front court really uh, uptight. So you're playing some man to man there with some traps. I mean, where's, you know, where do you guys feel like you're at with that, and where are the advantages of running that? Um, I feel like our traps are, uh, has have some some ways to go, but I feel like for the most part we did pretty good today. Though honestly, we just have to um, keep the ball more of uh, centered towards the middle. I mean, not towards the middle on one side of the court, so we can cut the other half off. But um, I feel like uh, as a as a whole, we're we're not too bad with the traps. <clears throat> You and Oscar finished with 11 offensive rebounds combined. Um, what is that? What is it like to have him next to you? Um, to have a player like Oscar, who's really a dynamic player, who's going to affect the ends on offense and defense. He, he's really a, a player that you should really watch out for. And I feel like me playing alongside with him, he takes a lot of pressure off of me. Because, uh, you know, last year they were just double and double and double. And I don't necessarily think they're going to be able to do that this year. So, you know, with Oscar alongside of me and him doing his thing, and then when they, whenever they double on him or do whatever, then they have to come back and guard me. So I feel like actually it's just like a, um, we're like a Swiss Army knife, to be honest with you. There's all types of things we can do. You guys been getting after it on the boards of practice? Yeah, yeah, we, uh, we've been battling hard. That's to make uh, Emar make sure we do, uh, do that every day on a daily basis. Um, coach always stresses rim run, rim run. So I feel like me battling with him and Mozzie all the time. You know, things will play out good. <clears throat> First game together with you two. I mean, how do you think your two's chemistry are? Today? Uh, I, I think it's. I, I want to say really, really good, but it, it's pretty good because for him to come in and as early as he had to learn things, I feel like he's making shots. So um, all I have to do is just feel like I just keep, like, you know, showing him things and little tips and little guides about here and there. I feel like he's, he, he's going to come to speed pretty quickly.